gigs I've ever taken pictures at because now they're stage set up, they have a lot of strobe lights going on and it's uh, quite a hard thing, I didn't know what was my flash, I didn't know what was going on, it was pretty heavy. But she's a great uh, fun girl, she was jumping all over the place and she fell right in front of me and I started taking photos. And the frame right after, after, right after this shot was her fist in my camera because I was way too close and uh, so she punched me because I was kind of bugging her so uh, and pleased to have it here in the exhibition. Um, well, I took this photo here, it's of a local band called Morning Hush. Um, the, we took it two days after Christmas and it was freezing cold and I think it was up in Rahini. Um, we were just kind of like in a, in a dog park and we found these really cool looking kind of shelters that sort of looked like UFOs and I just said, pop on under there and, and they did and it ended up looking great so that's, that's that. <laughs> Um, yeah, it was shot last year during the um, REM five night rehearsals in the Olympia. Something in particular, so it could be a bit more artistic in how I kind of shot the band. So that's why you can't see his face and lots of other shots I tried that night. A little bit more different than what you normally do at a gig. Yeah, well it's been running now for like a number of years. I curated it a couple of years ago. Um, this year it's probably bigger than ever before. Um, there's more photographers here than I've ever been before. And it's just a great way of getting bands and kind of uh, other industry people to see your work. Hi, I'm Martina MacDonald. My picture here up here on the wire. Um, it was just taken in a, in a car park and it was really overexposed because the, the, um, the light was shining down the tunnel so, and then it was raining so through strips. She, she took the photograph because, as you can see, of the kind of amazing figure of a man. I played music in a band called Bands on an Island, and um, I live in that car park where that was taken. Okay, um, I'm Lorena Rush, and I'm a music photographer, and I've been working as a photographer for about uh, three years now, maybe four years. And um, I mainly work with the music scene in Ireland, and I uh, work primarily in Dublin, and I've travelled across the UK as well. Um, the photograph I took is of Jade and Richie Egan. Um, we did the shoot up in uh, Roof in Smithfield and he's eating an apple because he was wearing this um, really, really nice kind of tile apple necklace and I thought it would be complimented by him eating an apple. <laughs> um, I think it's really, really important, the exhibition. Um, it's been, I suppose I've been involved in it for three years now and I created it last year and I just think that it's such a really, really good uh, leg up for like all the photographers to get their name out there and get the work out there and hopefully get people really, really interested in bands wanting uh, to work with What's come out? We, like, what came out of the woodwork and what's up on the walls over the weekend? 
weekend for everyone to see. And for me, it's just like out of this world. It's the level was just amazing. So that's all down to. Hi, I'm Phil, editor of State Magazine. Cause uh, yeah, we wanted to be part of this because. I feel there's, there's such a huge cultural community in Ireland, and uh, you know the bands are one part of it, but you know there's so much that goes around it—the designers, the photographers, and journalists, and whatever. So this was very important to be part of because yeah, you know, it's another reflection of, of cultural music and talent.